crazy how from the angle, from certain angles, it's like I don't got no top lip. And then from one angle, it'd be like, oh, there's a lot of it. But anyway. If somebody could be realizing something about angles. Because I was like looking at a picture and I was like, where's my top lip? And I'm like, oh, there it is. But, uh, somebody weren't okay somebody could be analyzing angles on somebody or something I don't know anyway <laughs> you will recover or heal oh somebody chose the wrong enemy child what they do it's time to have that talk woo <laughs> So if somebody is realizing something possibly from a different perspective, a different angle, okay, <laughs> somebody that once thought that you were an op, you were an enemy, you were a foe, they realize they choose the wrong opponent to come up, to go up against. Because I feel like for some of you guys, you ain't the enemy, you're not the op, you don't give a fuck. And they did some things, they did some things to hurt you. Especially if you will heal or recover, come out. Because you're, you, you're recovering, you're healing over something, or you will. Uh, the sun. So something's getting exposed. Something got exposed, and they was able to view something from a different perspective. Somebody is focused on their happiness now after all of what occurred. Somebody realized they chose the wrong enemy. Somebody chose the wrong fucking battle. That's clear as day. You may be a Leo in here. It may be a Leo. I don't think it's a Leo that chose the wrong enemy because this, this is up, right? Somebody's realizing, damn, it's time for me to focus on my happiness, my true success. There could be some type of exposure, recognition. What's really going on with the sun? Someone may have Leo in their chart. What's the sun? the emperor so it could be an aries in here it could be someone with aries in the chart but somebody's about to get good news because somebody for sure was being impulsive and just made an impulsive decision could be a capricorn when it came to some type of possessions control um money power and fame and not giving some type of resources or help not helping somebody out it could even be dealing with giving and um, donating um buying sharing it's, it's all, there's a relationship there's a part, somebody manipulated someone not to be in partnership not to be in union especially if your year two year three been going fucked up year two year three been going a little fucked up trying to keep you hidden depressed not having no type of collaborations no type of support no type of partnership no nothing just blockages disturbances nothing ever like falling through is just like stuck and getting in stuck in transaction in, in the transactions and how can i say transitions somebody feels stuck they've been feeling stuck for a while and somebody's been trying to have you stuck not finishing things not getting projects and things done and it's gonna be a tower moment because of that that somebody is not getting their way for fulfillment and you about to go off very quickly the queen of cups in the background that could be realizing they have to come to some type of resolution, some type of balance, instead of trying to one-up somebody, be in control, okay? Win at all costs, because there's a new opportunity and new love, damn. And there is something, some type of new finance, I said finances. Somebody could even be getting a new job, a new avenue of business, business avenue of new business adventure that they've been going on or about to embark on, and it's about to help them out financially. Yeah, because for sure somebody being sneaky and deceptive when it comes to a queen of pentacles, they're coming to some money, how they were getting things done. They could have been doing things in an unconventional way. Somebody could have been, um, it, it all could have been because of your race, status, background, upbringing, people that was above you, jealous of you, refusing to walk away from a situation, although they wasn't giving you like the support that you needed because whoever you are, you were very independent and financially stable you're you're very much on your own you know how to take care of business you're one step closer to the ten of pentacles and you speak the truth you might be a little bold about it okay you might be a little out there about it but it's the truth no n no bs okay there's no questions eyes there's this king of cups in here that's feeling a little lost scattered losing direction they want to give up on the situation this could even be them that was trying to hold you back somebody know that they need to come into full control of this situation bring some type of stability in here 
Someone's thinking about their future, their stability, again, their life now, looking at their situation, what the, what's going to come to them, king of swords. And that's the truth, because there was a lot of secrets and a lot of shit being done when it came to this person, whoever thought she was an enemy, that chose to go up against you. Yeah, a lot of secret plans and watching and stalking and somebody trying to juggle it out, but it ain't, it ain't adding up. And it, and it caused the instability when it came to a foundation, a marriage, a reunion, a family dynamic. It could even be a reunion coming up, a wedding coming up. There's some type of event coming up and it caused some type of instability in that. Or somebody realizing it is, is going to if they don't. Somebody could be planning something. What is this? Again, because somebody does not have, somebody wants to apologize for not giving somebody the support and the collaboration and help that they needed. They know by doing that, it, and then and, and stalking, like obsessively stalking them. Three of Cups in reverse. Like, this is a lot. Three, three, three of Cups in reverse. Three of, three of Pentacles in reverse. Like, child, being childish. Just making a lot of impulsive ass moves. And then spell work, too. Y'all, these people. Uh, all right. This is a lot. This is why they like, oh my goodness. It's time to talk. There's a lot of lies. There's a lot of betrayals going on. And you're leaving and you're going. And they stress out because you're not fighting back. So it's going to be a tower moment because it's all going to come out about what was being done. There could even be a uh, there could even be a Leo in here that needs to take responsibility and own up to their responsibilities on why their situation ended. Or there's a, there's a man that somebody is realizing they need to take responsibility and they need to have a talk with somebody about what really fucking went on because they know there's an ending that's coming. Nine of Wands hurt somebody's a heart wounded soldier. They already. Uh, they can't balance this, the, what they did to split two people up, what they did to keep somebody out of a partnership, some type of collaboration. They know they hurt somebody. Oh, jeez, Louise. Y'all, <laughs> I'm not mature enough to have talks to people about this. I, I, I don't want to deal with them. But prepare because you will heal. You will recover. There could even be some type of unexpected income, money. For all the stalking and watching, observing. Yeah, you it will come out. This person this person may even this person is making a decision to come up out of the cold and release something or let go of whatever they was holding on to. It could even be resentments. It could even be a conversation for this new beginning. What they did with this new beginning, how they purposely wasted it. It's okay, whatever. Alright. So this person is ready to have a talk to you guys. Get prepared. They're ready to come up out of the club. They're ready to talk to you. Hmm. Mm. Okay, let's pick a love card since I guess we're going love. I don't know what the hell this is, y'all. And I'm want to get out what is this separation and then for a reconciliation you know good patience. so time apart is on the horizon time apart for your partner is on the horizon someone from your past is returning I'm required of love but then there's chemistry then there's forgiving and like so some of you guys had to release your I don't know. you guys don't have to figure out what the hell you're going to do I guess after this talk Y'all gonna figure out what to do. There was a celebration. I mean, there was a separation. Then it will be a coming back together. There may even be a separation for a little bit because somebody's realizing they went up against their lover for you guys to come back together. If some of you guys, you are leaving somebody alone to for somebody from your past to return or you left somebody alone for somebody from your past that returned and they realized it was all bullshit. They just didn't want to see them happy. They were trying to stop you or them. Somebody realizing something. And then they ready to take responsibility and let you know what really went on. Why they really came back. It was all out of jealousy. Somebody was work, really working against somebody. What's really going on?
guess there is no message. But it's time to have that talk. But are they real? Child, this is ridiculous. Whoever you are, though, you will heal. You will recover. You will find stability again. I guess we're going to leave it at that. It ain't shit for this person that they really want to talk about. So, uh, that's what I was about to say. All these damn talks. Sometimes, what do you get out of a talk? Some people be wanting closure. I ain't never got... What are you going to... I feel you leaving me behind. It's time for me to heal now. Like, what? I don't think the talk is going to do anybody any justice. You need to go about your separate way. Nine of Wands, keep moving, going forward. Separate and go about your business. Because, what the fuck? For some of you guys, this person is going to let you know why they left, why they separated from you. Okay, for some of you guys, they know you're leaving them behind and that's why they're coming back to bring stability in your life. They chose the wrong enemy. They could have, again, they thought you was their enemy. They thought you was going up against them. Some of you guys, you are rekindling with this person after some separation that occurred. And it had to happen this way so both of you guys could have gained your strength, your confidence, could have learned some shit. They got, I want you. I know exactly what I was doing. So they knew they were playing games. They knew they hurt you. They know. And it happens that way sometimes. Sometimes you got to leave to grow stronger so the heart can grow fonder or some shit of that nature. You were the best thing in my life. So again, this person already know. All right. I'm going to put three for my deck and I'm going to go. Wow. Bullshit and you keep bouncing back from it all. Do what you do, but watch my shoes. So did somebody for sure picked the wrong enemy. And you was allowing them. You didn't care. Again, if somebody thought you was against them. And you was like, no, I'm going to give a fuck what you do. Do what you do, but watch my shoes, okay? Watch my shoes. Don't go stepping all over my shoes and stepping over my toes. Like, you can dance with your boo, but watch my shoes. You know what I'm saying? Like, do what the fuck ever it is that you're doing. But just keep me out your mix. And somebody didn't understand that. They were so worried about you and thinking you was the enemy. They realized now they chose the wrong enemy. Whatever they got into was bullshit. They kept sending you shit and they was doing shit to you. All what I seen was just all bullshit. And you just keep bouncing back from it all. Like, this is weird. Yeah, shake that bad energy off of you. Dance, laugh, sing, cry, eat, go pray. It was all a blessing in disguise. Yeah, you will soon be in the relationship. Clear as day. All right, I love you guys so much. Take care.